What's up, YouTube? Top City 5401 Hill Road to 5000, video number 17, pickup card number 4901 and 4902. So I'm going to have a quick discussion about these cards because both of these are relics. One is from 2002 and one is from, I think, 2016. And let's compare the authentication on these relics. I've discussed this before, but I have a lot of new viewers, and this is always a fun topic, something I enjoy talking about. So on this 2002 Stadium Club, the front of the card says, Authentic Games Used Bat and Authentic Game Worn Jersey. And then on the back of the card, it has this wonderful hologram. And this hologram, if you go on the TOPS website and you punch in that number on the hologram, it will authenticate the relics on the front of this card. Really cool, something I wish Tops would have continued to do. I think they did that for a couple of years. So cool card, great authentication, wonderful, wonderful, wonderful. Here is a modern relic card. So we got a dual bat card from Panini Pantheon. I believe this is 2016 Pantheon. But the authentication on the back, listen to this, okay? The Enclosed game used material is guaranteed by Panini America Incorporated. And when you think about it, what the back of this card is saying is there's game used material and Panini is guaranteeing that there's game used material in this card. What it doesn't say is it doesn't say who used the game used material, what kind of game the game used material was used in, and what the material is. So, in other words, this is a Barry Bonds card, but the material could have been used by Jeff Kent in a softball game in a beer league from his uh, his neighborhood, and it could have been like a, a seat used on a bench from the softball game in his beer league. I mean, it's, it's, I mean, obviously, that's not where the relic came from. Also, the odds of the relic on this card being bat relics from a Major League Baseball game used by Barry Bonds are very, very, very tiny. I would be shocked if these were bat relics from Barry Bonds in a Major League Baseball game. Now, I'm not complaining about this card. I'm just stating a fact. So when I buy cards like these newer relic cards, I buy them knowing that the relics inside are not, probably not, from the player pictured on the card and they're probably not what the company wants you to believe they are, if that makes sense. However, on the older cards, that have the wonderful, wonderful, wonderful authentication, I can be a lot more confident that what I have in a card like this is a bat and a jersey used by Barry Bonds in a Major League Baseball game. So anyways, just wanted to kind of start a little discussion. You guys can comment down below, share your thoughts. Want to see what you guys think, and I just wanted to share the two pickups and just kind of give my thoughts on it. So anyways, comment down below, let me know what you think, and as always guys, love this hobby and happy collecting!